To get started, let's go to dbflash.com. From here, click Explore Modules. Here we have all the module listed. Go through and decide for which module would you like to have section layout. For this example, we'll select Timeline module. Let's click on More Info option to navigate on Timeline module's landing page. From here, we can click on View Demo to see all the section layout made using this particular timeline module. Similarly, for each module, you will find available section layouts. We also have another page from where you can navigate to demo page. Go back to DB Flash website. From the navigation bar, hover over to layout and click module demo. Here in this table, you can search for the module name and click view demo to preview all the demos we made. Also, you can download all the section layout at once. In this video, I'm going to use one section layout. So let's go back to the demo page. Here we have all the designs. Let's download the first one. Okay, download completed. And it's available in my desktop download folder as a JSON file. Okay, now let's move on to the site where we would like to use this. This is my WordPress website where I have DV theme installed. We need to make sure we have DV Flash plugin installed and active. We also need to confirm our module is active before uploading the JSON file. To do so, let's go to the modules inside DV Flash plugin and navigate to timeline module. See, it's disabled. Let's enable it and click save changes. Now we are ready to upload JSON file. We have two ways to upload file. One is here in DV library and other one is from the visual builder while working on a page. We'll check both of them. Let's click import and export button and a portable import export option will pop up. From here choose import option. Then choose the downloaded file and click open. Lastly import. Now the file is uploading. And here it is. This is the first method. Now let's move on to the visual builder to see how we can use this. Also how we can upload file directly on the page. From the pages click all page. I already have a page created here and I would like to add the timeline section here after hero section. Let's do it. Let's enable the visual builder first. Now click on the blue plus icon to add new section. Here we will select add from library. See our uploaded layout is here. We can click on it and select use this section. Let's presume we did not upload the file yet. Let me delete this one and I'll show how to upload file directly here. See this import icon on top left, click on it and choose file. Then click import button and file will be imported. Now select the section and click use this section button. This will add the section to the page. See it's here. Now you can click on module settings and customize it 
according to your information and requirements. Once done, save or publish it, then exit Visual Builder to see the design from front end. That's it from this tutorial. I hope this will help. See you on the next one.